welcome to our chapel. This is the first chapel for our new semester in the January 2020. Miss Tessia is very happy to see all of you to praise the Lord and to listen to the Bible story together. Now we are going to start our chapel. Before that, let us pray together. Close your eyes, hold your hands, let's pray. Dear God, Thank you for your blessing. We can start our chapel together. We are thankful for your love, for your guidance, and we can start our school again. We have our holiday. Now we are going to have our chapel. Please lead us in the chapel and to praise your name joyfully and also listen to the story attentively. Uh, Thank you, God. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Now, we are going to praise the Lord. Everybody stand up. Let's sing the song following this video. Okay? Let's sing. <laughs> I like to think about the goodness of the Lord. Gives me everything I need and so much more. So I just want to lift my hands and say that I love Him. I just want to lift my heart in praise. And I want to be faithful. I want to be faithful. I want to remember everything that the Lord has done. I want to be thankful. I want to be me everything I need and so much more. So I just want to lift my hands and say that I love him. I just want to lift my heart in Today, we are going to learn about Be Grateful. Now, Miss Tasha will play you a video about what is to be grateful. So, let's check the video together. So, I'm going to ask you a couple of questions. I'm right. so excited. <laughs> Happy, thankful, good, good, very, good. very happy, amazing. <laughs> if you don't say thank you when somebody gives you a present, it can hurt their feelings. Exactly. People understand how much we care about them. Because it's nice to say it and they're probably a good person. So that they understand that what they do actually makes a difference. Like to make them feel good about what they did, then they're gonna keep doing it and they're gonna feel better about themselves. It makes whoever gives the present uh, make them feel happy that they like it. Exactly. They gave us something and we didn't say thank you, that's not being nice. Yeah. Because if you don't say thank you, it 
still hurt the feelings. Exactly. Sometimes I wish I could get that gift. <laughs> From the video, we can see and hear that grateful is by saying thank you. So what about from the Bible? Let's check. In the Ephesians 5 verse 20, it is said, Always giving thanks to God the Father for everything in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. So let's repeat one more time. Always giving thanks to God the Father for everything in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. So, why we should be grateful to God? Because He creates everything and we can enjoy everything that God made for us, for our life. Isn't it that great? Isn't it God is good? Yeah, right? So let's mention what is the thing that we can say thank you to the Lord. Let's see. So we can be thankful for the earth. We are living on the earth. That what God made. We also can say thank you to the Lord for the sun. So that we can see the light. And we can dry our clothes outside by using the sunlight. We also can say thank you to the Lord for the rain so that the trees can drink from the water from it isn't it great what else we also can be thankful for our family mommy daddy brother sister grandma grandpa auntie uncle that's all also from god and remember we also living in the house right everyone are living in this house so that's also from God. God allow us to have a house so we can live inside of the house. And not to forget, we also have our friends. You have your friends at your home. You have your friends in the school. So that's also from God. We are thankful for that, right? We also can be thankful for our healthy body. So we can do a lot of things with our fit body, right? We also can be thankful for the food that we can eat every day that is prepared from your mom or your daddy. We also be thankful for the school. We can have our school even though because of the pandemic we are having our online class. But we are thankful. We have the internet connection. We have the gadget that we can use to have the class together. Isn't it great? God is very, very good to prepare everything for us. And we can be thankful for a lot of things again. Maybe you can mention more about that later with your teacher in the class. We are also thankful for Jesus that he loves us. So we can love others too. That's also important to be thankful for, right? Now how to be grateful to God yes we can say thank you to the Lord by saying our prayer we also can read the Bible to know more about God's word nah we also can be loving to other friend we can share to our friend we can speak nicely to our friend that's also one way to be grateful to the Lord we also can finish our food that's also the way for us to say thank you for the food that we can have from mommy and daddy right i think there are a lot of things that you can do and you can explore more about that and you can mention about it later in the class with your teacher too so that's about the lesson for today about the chapel story for today we are learning to be grateful we are thankful to the lord about everything that god has made
Do you still remember the song? Give thanks to the Lord. Give thanks to the Lord. For He loves you. He loves me too. Give thanks to the Lord our God. Yes, today we are learning about how to be grateful just like what the Bible says. We are giving thanks to the Lord for everything that He has made. Just like today, even though we cannot have our school in the class, but we can have our internet connection, we have our gadgets, so we still can have our online learning. We also get our healthy body, so we still can have our activities just like usual. That's also the thing that we can be thankful for. So now we are going to close our chapel together. Let's close your eyes, fold your hands, let's pray to the Lord. Dear God, thank you for the chapel. Thank you for the lesson that we learned today to be grateful and to be thankful for everything that you has made for us. Thank you for the healthy body, thank you for the online learning, thank you for the friends, for the teacher, for the family, for everything that you already given to us. Now we are going to continue our activity. Please bless us and please be with us. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. Let's be thankful, let's be grateful. See you on the next chapel. Bye-bye. Thank you.